vlog one welcome back to my channel it is your girl Sasha and guys do you notice anything different <laughs> your girl has got a beautiful beautiful backdrop here I'm loving it guys I ordered from Amazon if you guys are have a channel and you're interested in this backdrop then I will put the link below so you guys can get it video as well it. so guys I'm trying to film two videos in one this is video is gonna be a little wig review and also an install and then i'm gonna do a separate video which will follow up on this one or probably come before this one and that will be a makeup look so guys i haven't done that in a while so it should be an exciting video so the wig that i want to talk to you guys is about guys i wanted to do an unboxing and first impressions but I had an event my friend was getting married and I had to do this as quickly as possible so I didn't get to film at all if I if I can retrieve some of the clips that I started I would insert them anywhere here and guys yeah so the hair is born I just want to kind of show you guys I didn't comb it through anything I wanted to show you guys how it looked after I have used it the first time it has a beautiful beautiful curl pattern which you're not seeing now because I, the, the time it was windy the wedding was very windy it was blowing all over the place so it needs to be revived so i'm going to show you guys basically how i go about and did and do oh. that so guys first and foremost my first impression of this wig was that it had a beautiful curl pattern this wig is from nice light and this is their remy it is a 12 inch bob and it is a remy texture now guys Immediately out of the package, the curl, pack, the curl pattern was super, super good. There was no smell to the wig. And I was really amazed by the texture. It didn't say Brazilian or Malaysian or anything like that. So I was like, hmm, I wonder what quality I'm getting. This wig was like $60, guys. But $60 well spent. Because it's not at all expensive. Mm -hmm. The quality is unmatched. I don't think I've ever had a curly wig that give me this vibe and normally when you have curly wigs curly wigs tend to tangle a lot this i have not received any tangle. remember i worn this and i did not comb through it or anything and my hands just slips right through i don't get tangles from this neither do i get any form of shedding hold on hold is that one is that one or is it my mind but I have received no form of shedding and you know curly hair tend to get tangled even a small bit but this one I have not received any tangle I didn't have to comb it through while I was at the event and normally sometimes when I get wigs I'm like literally combing to kind of tame it but this just kept the curl pattern and it was bomb right through so guys I did some customization oh the lace came in R right now I didn't wash it as yet so you know how you would bleach the knots? I don't normally bleach my knots because I'm trying not to get excessive shredding. Plus, I'm trying not to ruin the wig because I'm not a professional on that. But what I did was I used concealer underneath the... Oh, the most important thing. This is a closure. And I was not aware of this. I've never bought a closure wig. I've always done full lace. But this is a 4x4 closure. And I was a bit intimidated because I'm like, how am I going to get a side part in this? Normally, I wear my wigs in side parts. But guys, it literally was, it, it was not, like you would think that it is a full, full lace frontal. It did not look like a closure. I didn't even, for some reason, I was not educated that much. I didn't know that wigs came like that. So the lace, as I said, guys, it was, it blends so beautiful without my skin. I just went in and I add a little bit more concealer underneath and kind of just brush it so that I could get it as close to my shade as possible. And that kind of took out the knots, you know, and it looks just like skin. It came pre-plucked the airline was look you can see that the airline is plucked and gorgeous guys look at the airline like come on now guys for 60 dollars this is a whole whole different level so guys it came pre-plucked and everything the only thing it for, for the closure it was from here to here and it had about an inch of lace and all i did i just kind of cut the lace off you know when you're cutting the lace you kind of do it in zigzag motion so that it can imitate the airline and so does it doesn't look too wiggy so that is all i did in terms of customization it does come with combs it has one two four combs so 
two towards the sides against the the um, closure and then you have two at the back and it does come with an elastic band which helps for added security which I kind of tightened it already as you can see guys so let us go and put this baby on what I realize is closure now hold on I'm gonna just kind of flip the hair back and kind of go from the back and pull it forward my hair now it's not laid flat because guys I'm just gonna do this for the video and I'm not too concerned with that because the thing the thing with wigs is that um, when it's a curly wig you can get away without not not having to do your hair too flat underneath because it's curly anyway it's gonna be bouncy but if it's a flat hair don't skip the part that you know don't skip their car nose basically so I'm gonna bring that slightly in front of I'm gonna kind of push this back a little bit then I'm gonna bring this to the front as close as I can and then I don't normally use the combs the combs are very uncomfortable for me in any wig and as you can see guys making it look like a closure i kind of this it would be the center of the wig i kind of tilt it to the side instead of parting it because i was more secure with this part and guys as you can see it is plucked the the parting is plucked so it looks so good so the parting is plucked so it just comes off and it already looks so natural guys to be honest you can go and you can wear it like that you don't even have to secure it at all at all i'm just gonna use got to be got to be glue so guys to secure it i'm gonna kind of pull this back because i know where i'm gonna put it and then i'm gonna use my got to be to kind of spritz it in just at the front like that and guys you can use a blow dryer and kind of just speed up the process but guys my blow dryer i have no plugins next to me so i'm just gonna have to kind of use my hands to do that because so i kind of go in with a second dosage oh i don't want it to go down onto my face yeah so we're kind of waiting for it to get tacky yeah, guys so once you do and you get a bit tacky you want to pull forward not until your airline is down here as i see some persons do that's not cute so you want to kind of pull down and then you kind of hold down onto the sides to kind of set and kind of squeeze you want to ensure that this part that you your part is you want to ensure that that is as flat as possible and guys got to be alone does a big deal so let me just kind of pose for a picture here Cause I don't know what that is. <laughs> so guys, yeah. So look at that. It just kind of just blends in and just looks beautiful regardless. You're not doing anything. So guys, you kind of just want to go in and kind of perfect the part as best as possible. But my natural hairline, I don't have a straight part. So it just goes perfectly. It just works perfectly because my airline is a bit my my part tends to be a bit sparse so that's not a problem at all so guys now we're gonna search for the baby hairs so I already had taken them out and cut them just a small amount of the baby hairs a bit difficult And what I use is I use this mousse. This is the Oris olive oil wrap set mousse. Right. And I use enough to kind of just have it laid. So to get your little toothbrush and you kind of. I don't go excessively with the baby hairs guys. Because I like when things look natural and I think. A lot of persons kind of just overdo the baby hairs and it kind of just comes off and look a bit weird. So you just kind of soup. Soup de doops. And trust me guys, the mousse is enough to hold this 
baby down without making look it look too crisp and unnatural so guys once the baby hair starts acting right you kind of just want to tie that down because you kind of want to set the earline and have that lace melt down into like scalp you know and look as real as possible so you kind of want to tie the hair down so i'm just gonna switch over and we are gonna go into the makeup session and i might include it in this video or i just might do it in a separate video so if not next video you will see will be me in my makeup so let us see what happens <laughs> so guys we are back and we are beautiful let us get to the hair portion all right Oh, yep. She's ready. She is ready. Oh, I got makeup all over my hair. So, guys, I have nothing to do. So, guys, I kind of want to clean up the part by going in with concealer right into the parting portion. it everything just kind of just blends seamlessly and effortlessly all right you shouldn't be able to tell where the lace is and that is what i love about this hair guys you when it melts so well you can't tell where the lace really begins like Ooh. yeah guys we are off to an awesome awesome thing so here we are we have the hair laid down the hair is looking beautiful even though the curls are very old and all i would do here is i will spritz the hair with water in this i have some latter body a little bit of latter body with barely any in it and water so i'm just gonna lightly spritz the hair and they're gonna just watch the curl just come alive guys guys look <laughs> guys let me tell you about this hair real quick this hair is the bomb.com point blank period so when i have that saturation i'm just gonna go in with some mousse mousse is what's gonna hold the curl guys this curl lasts forever this is the best curl here i have ever used i'm just gonna say that much and i'm confident to say that because it's the truth and i've had some really good curl here but this one is different look at that guys the hair just kind of just pops up and the curls just oh my god look the parting lays so flat it just the hair is perfect guys you see you see the shorter pieces that are here i didn't touch it i this is not my customization the wig came just like that customized to perfection trimmed and cut and everything and styled so that when you put it on it's just time to go and you are ready to go that is it guys you can go ahead and use your brush but you don't need to because this hair is so it curls up by itself without any help with teasing and all of that and a lot of persons are not used to it. I, I literally have never worn hair this short. The shortest length I have went with um, like virgin hair is 18 inches. I've never gone shorter than that instead of virgin hair. Except for my straight bob, which is a bob. Obviously, it's going to be short. So yeah, guys, <laughs> that is our hair. And this will dry up and it will keep the curls and the curls will be bomb and guys I can't complain I cannot complain so let me just show you the hair I 
a pattern. Let's get a close up. What lace? What lace, guys? <laughs> so, guys, yes, that is my my wig install and how I revive the hair and make it look super. Guys, it can even look even more curly and defined by this, but I'm trying to keep the fluffy look. I'm really not trying to go all out, but the wetter you get it and the more you kind of tease it around, it just gets very beautiful. And it is not thin here it's like very fluffy and it looks good and you are gonna just feel really beautiful in this hair so guys if you like this let me know in the comments down below and i will go ahead and do more wig reviews and if you like the hair just let me know down also in the comments down below guys the makeup is done and you know that i filmed it just now when i'm installing the hair so if you are watching this video now go ahead and hop on over to see this beautiful beautiful makeup look so guys your girl will be protective styling a lot because she got a hair that is lightweight and it looks good nice light you did the damn thing with this hair this hair is bomb.com so guys thank you for watching and i'll see you next time Ta -da!